can we can have another universe inside the black hole mathematics adds up neil degrasse tyson okay is it possible that our universe exists inside a black hole yeah so how do we ascertain whether that's the case what what are the what are the facts that we know of that are undisputable our universe has a certain size not the universe but the observable universe the observable universe that we can see it has a diameter of about 90 95 trillion light years is it billion is it trillion it's billion it's billion 95 billion light years okay beyond that there is a universe out there but we can't see beyond that so we have an observable horizon of about 90 95 billion light years in diameter so it's like we are at the center of a sphere and all around us at a radius of, of about 45 47 billion light years we can see beyond that we can't see but clearly there's a universe beyond that because the universe as we know is expanding and every day certain galaxies are going beyond the observable horizon so that's what we know that we live in a sphere that we can observe and beyond that there's something out there but we have no access to it because of the limitations of light speed now we know that the universe is expanding there is observational evidence that demonstrates this nobody can dispute that okay red shifting and so on galaxies we can see that the universe is, is expanding and the expansion is accelerating we also know that a big bang happened an initial singularity or or compressed point was there from which everything ex- expanded outwards it was not an explosion it was an expansion of space time and we know this because we have the cosmic microwave background radiation which is the afterglow of the big bang right that faint radiation that that permeates empty space which is not really empty so the question is inside a black hole can you have a situation when the, where, where there is expanding space time and cosmic microwave background radiation is it possible to have that inside a black hole well if you look at the einstein field equations and what they say you will find that that kind of doesn't add up okay the einstein field equations that's what albert einstein came up with in 1915 and the field equations say there are two sides the left side is talks about geometry the geometry of the universe and the right side is about the matter and density the matter and energy composition of the universe and these two balance out so matter tells space time how to curve and the curvature of space time tells matter how to move that sort of thing now if you look at the einstein field equations and you factor in other things it doesn't look like a black hole should have this sort of stuff inside a black hole you can model it as a bag of photons or a, bla- or a bag of fuzzballs or whatever but still you don't have the situation of an expanding space time inside a black hole and all so i would say it is rather unlikely that we may be inside a black hole but who knows it's not like we know all of physics we know we actually know next to nothing of physics despite whatever advances we have we've made so anything is possible at the end of the day we don't quite know what's inside a black hole right we can only describe what's inside a black hole using using the equations and the theories that we have the best theory is general relativity we also have quantum mechanics and quantum field theory but they don't give you all the answers because something is missing some pieces are missing so i would say at the end of the day it's possible but from what we know it looks somewhat unlikely but we don't know everything so it's possible okay